All right, so... Turn and burn. <laughs> this is turn and burn for Game Boy. Okay. Uh, this game is... Um, turn and burning. This game's terrible. Oh, is it? <laughs> it is incredibly boring. The F-14 Dogfight Simulator. Now, the reason I was curious in the, with this is uh, I see on the front here, it is, quote, very hot. <laughs> According to Nintendo Power... Oh, February 1992. All right, let's see if I can find this here. Nintendo Power. We've got Game Boy Gradius, the inner cell. Wait, issue 33? This is February. No joke. What? Whoa. Oh, we lost Dave. We lost it. <laughs> <laughs> I have it right here. You found it. <laughs> That's coincidental. <laughs> I thought this looked familiar. All right, so we need... Yeah? Volume 33 must have been an important volume. It was on sale. <laughs> um, players Forum, Tips from the Pros. <gasps> Legends of the Mystical Ninja. <laughs> oh, for Super Nintendo. Is that one we got to play sometime? Oh, yeah. Whoa, Zelda comics, Super Mario Brothers comics, Nestor's Adventures comics. Oh, Nestor's There's Adventures. There's so much good stuff. <laughs> ah! All right, but we're here on a mission. Okay, Katana. Whoa. I need to find... Whoa, Maximum <laughs> 90s. G. Yeah. Joe. Well, I guess G.I. Joe is from the 80s. Looks like Hudson Hawk. <laughs> Rempart. <laughs> That's a crazy game. Have you played Rampart? No. It's like te Tetris plus uh, plus uh, like Civilization. Oh, it's, that sounds so, super interesting. Right. So you get a bunch of, there's a building phase where you get these Tetris looking blocks and you build up your fortress. And uh -huh. then there's a defense phase and you have to defend uh, defend your fortress and you chip away the blocks. Oh, that's so amazing. What's this game called? I'm going to play it. Rampart. Rampart. I'm going to play it. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Simpsons game, which means it's stupid crazy hard. <laughs> There's the comic. I love these comics. Oh my god, I remember these. <laughs> I bought <laughs> so they actually re released the um they re released the Super Mario World comics. They re released it. Like it was sold at Target, like not that long ago, maybe ten Recently? years ago. Oh. Yeah, and you could buy we we have a copy upstairs. The whole a whole bound nicely bound copy official. I love it so much. I've read through it so many times with my kids. I would love to get the Zelda. They, they had, as oh, far yeah. as I know, they didn't make a Zelda, a bound Zelda version. Oh. Uh, Faceball 2000, yeah. Special Agents Wanted. Oh, Nestor, right. there he is. Mm -hmm. We still need, okay, Gradius 2. Super Hunchback. <laughs> Super Hunchback. I wonder, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dave. You've been yeah. diagnosed with Super Hunchback. <laughs> I love these random drawings. <laughs> this little guy. <laughs> He's, He's got a great. super hunchback. He's yeah, got his he fedora. Does. Oh, really? Yep. He's like my hunchback. <laughs> my hunchback. <laughs> Terminator 2. This he game is... He said bag. <laughs> That's what it awesome. said. No, I didn't come up with that. That's what it said at the top. It's like he said he'd be back. <laughs> Whoa! It's so... <laughs> Oh my god. He said he'd be back. Yeah, he'd probably, okay, asteroids. <laughs> How much can you say about asteroids? Oh, yeah, this is the one oh, we have. Yeah. Oh my god, I remember these. I remember these so much. I love doing the voices. <laughs> Yoshi! Whoa! 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 It's legendary. PG 13. Yeah! Oh, are you familiar with the Chinooki statues? Yeah! Okay. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> in the yeah, it's in the, well in the beginning of the Legend of Mystical Ninja stage. He's yeah. like, "This is a dangerous zone." Yeah. Like. Oh, that's, that's what the statue says. Yeah, the statue. What was another one? Craigie. <laughs> yeah, like in the beginning of the stage, he's like, "This is a dangerous zone." I see. Oh. <laughs> okay, Lantern Man. This is Super Nintendo. Oh yeah. This is cool. Yeah, it's super Japanese. <sighs> All right, lemmings. Oh, the poster. <laughs> I used to have that poster hanging on my wall. Oh, uh, did you? Yeah. Do you think lemmings is for people who need to grow up to be like managers and stuff? 
Because you organ because you uh you're uh what is it? You're directing a team right. of right, yeah of characters. Yeah. Super scope. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, I never had super the scope. Bazooka. I never uh, had a... super scope. Can you believe that? Mm, I can well did anybody have a super scope? I don't know. That's what I mean. Like I don't think anyone had a super scope. <laughs> even, even you didn't have it? I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I had um, a lot of cobbles back then. <laughs> And I did not have the super scope. Um, what was I thinking? You said, shoot, what were we just talking about? Super Hunchback, Tanuki. Oh, Lemmings yeah. for managers? That's a good question. Oh. <laughs> I think, no joke, when I played Harvest Moon, I have the Game Boy version. When I you played Harvest Moon, I did not become a farmer. I did not become <laughs> Farmer Dave. I, like, I could feel my time management, like in real life, improving. <laughs> no joke. And then I take a break from it, and I was like, "Wow, I could really use a boost." And then I play through the game again, and I'm like, "Oh man, yeah, time management." Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Oh, Blastrous is a cool name for a game. Yeah. All right, counselors. Corn oh no, I need the reviews. Chrysalis, baseball. Baseball. Ah, <sighs> be an astronaut. <laughs> hey, that could be me. <laughs> well, I mean, look, that kid's having a great time. Nestor's Adventures with <laughs> Super Castlevania 4. Beware of everything. Oh, come <laughs> on. Okay, George. Okay, two, now playing. So wow. we got the reviews. That's so funny. You know what I realized? These uh, George and Rob's now playing. This is like, this is, this is like YouTube retro game reviews. Oh, yeah. In paper form. And they just yeah. chat back and forth. Uh, the new Simpsons game for the NES title, Bart Simpson vs. World, has action scenes that are along the lines, blah, 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 blah. Only Bart Simpson could have a game titled Bart vs. the World. Okay. We've got that. Bart vs. the World. Okay. TMNT 3. Okay. Rampart. Jaleco. Okay. Yeah, like, I was telling my mom, um, did you ever watch the game Who's Last? Or not. Well, I guess it was a game. Oh, the TV show? Yeah, the TV show Who's Last It Anyway. Yes, I have. That is a very funny show. Well, yeah, well, that's what I was saying. I was telling my mom that I used to love it, but I feel like it doesn't hold up. It doesn't hold up? I feel like it doesn't hold up because I feel like the stuff, like film dub, right? There's one of the games they do where they have like a yeah, movie oh, yeah, yeah. and they have no volume and then the guys just like, you know, improv what the people are saying and stuff like that. And I was just like, well, you know, we have that all the time now on YouTube. Like, you could just find any sort of video of someone doing that. You and know what I mean? They're good? <laughs> oh, my like, gosh. We yeah. start talking about, like, um, Mystic Science Theater and all those yeah. kinds of things. And I'm like, yeah, these are just called React channels now. Like, you just go to, like, any sort of React channel and there's people, like, reacting to stuff like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, interesting. Huh. Also, it kind of got low key racist here and there. What did? <laughs> Who's lied? You ever see those things where they're like, oh, give us a fake uh, language to oh, make no. up? <laughs> and then they'll be like, oh, do, you know, Netherlands and go, her, her, her. Oh, no. <laughs> like, uh... <laughs> I see. Yeah, like it gets a little. Uh, a <laughs> little dicey. A little dicey. It's a little dicey. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Look at this. This triggered me. Bucky uh -oh. O'Hare. Bucky O'Hare is based on a new cartoon. It's a game for young players. George, it's a decent game. Seriously? This game's great. Oh, legendary. Legendary. Yeah. Everyone oh, loves oh, everyone loved what? Bucky O'Hare? I love Bucky O'Hare. I feel like I feel like you know, Bucky O'Hare was like the hidden gem of the NES. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of people didn't know it existed, but mm -hmm. if you did know, you loved it. <laughs> If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Bucky O'Hare was the best. Oh, Bucky. here we go. Captain Bucky O'Hare. <laughs> I thought Blaster Master Boy was a lot of fun. Uh, blah, 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 blah. All right. I'm a real, George says, I'm a real fan of Blaster Master for the NES, and this game has nothing to do with the original. He's correct. Mm. This game is, uh, they call it Blaster Master Boy to get it to sell. Right. It had nothing to do with Blaster Master. Mm. It has a completely different name in uh Ah, uh, it is Japan. a bummer. But yeah, like, you know, like this. Yeah, you're right. Like, this stuff, like, this is just two guys talking about games. Like, that's all over the internet. Like, yeah. what, like why do I care about these guys' opinions? 
Who are We're looking for oh turn and burn. Huh? We're oh, trying yeah, to find turn and burn. <laughs> I was trying to talk about you know, YouTube reactors. <laughs> yeah, you're doing great. <laughs> oh my god. Is oh, that, yeah. that like uh, the Kelly Williams and Darius. <laughs> They're the Winslows, oh, right? Like this is yeah, they are the they're, Winslows. They're like uh, Laura and Eddie. What's her brother's name? Eddie. <laughs> there we go. Family Matters. On Family Matters, Kelly plays Laura Winslow, Urkel's unrequited love. <laughs> Laura. Oh, there they are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Eddie and Laura. <laughs> and Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, and then he was Sonic. So oh. funny. Okay, is it future? Contra 3? <laughs> Electronic it's just arts. games they wish happened? No, this game's... So, <laughs> the games that are coming out, I think in many, many times, these are games that are, like, already released in Japan so they could get mm. easy photos. Oh, okay. What's this? There it is! Oh, so, what? game's coming out. So, it hadn't come out yet. So, before uh -huh. they made the American box art... Let's see, the scramble is on to make a combat flight simulator for Game Boy, and Konami's entry, Top Gun Guts and Glory, is right there at the top of the class. This game earns its wings with a wide range of options. One or two players, really? Air <laughs> combat, bombing runs, career path, which includes all types. Is it really two player? Where'd my thing go? Nope, single player, according to the box art. Well, okay. wait, this is Top Gun Guts and Glory, right? Oh, wait, oh, wrong game. You're right. Yeah, oh, trying to burn. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Classy competition now. for the honor of best Game Boy Flight Simulator comes from Absolute's Turn and Burn, the dog fight simulator by Gary Kitchen, the creator of Super Battle Tank. One player, uh -huh. one player, can fly okay. against computer controlled bogeys. The early version we saw had fewer options than Top Gun, but flight controls are better. Both games are kind mm -hmm. of garbage. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you can actually see the stick in front of you, and you have total control over engine thrust. Total control up and down. There is also <laughs> a mission screen that leads you to target your target and keeps track of bogeys and scoring. You are even given a briefing before the mission, which tells oh. you what is expected, how many bogeys are out there, and their headings. <laughs> From the launch sequence to the sound effects of the engine, which revs up or down Ooh. as you increase and decrease power, Turn and burn closely matches the real flying experience of a Navy pilot. Quote, <laughs> very hot. There it is. <laughs> That's what they put on the box. Oh, look at this. Look at the screenshot. The screenshot on the right here. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's, it's like an empty screen. Got like one dot. dot. <laughs> one dot on it. <laughs> look at these graphics. Dot simulator. Uh. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, nice. I didn't expect really you to go like this far to see the review for Turn and Burn. I have been loving, I have been loving go rereading uh, old issues in the Nintendo Power. I didn't realize, <laughs> I didn't realize the '90s had a vocabulary. It had its oh, own yeah. grammar. It oh, is, yeah. it is very nostalgic. Yeah, do I swear, it's so funny, like how much, you know, like I. Weirdly, like recently, I've been getting um, these things for uh, like you know little recommended shorts, and it's like little clips of Full House, mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's like it's always funny, like just how like this one scene. Okay, Uncle Jesse was rocking. Uncle out, Jesse, okay, and he was doing a bunch of Elvis, you know, and like that was considered cool yet. You know what I mean? Like they were rocking and they were listening to Elvis, and I'm like, at that time, that's like a 30 year old song. <laughs> you know what I mean? If this is the 80s, then that's like a 30 year old song, but it was still like relevant. I don't know. That's like <laughs> me, like, like saying, oh, who would listen to like Bootylicious by Destiny's Child? <laughs> I. That's a 30 year old song. <laughs> Oh, uh, yep, yep. I don't think you're ready for this. <laughs> I'm not ready for this, Sam. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that was another thing that popped up on my recommended, too. <laughs> Gossip galore. Wow. Gossip galore. Like, <gasps> these are just random oh, people. Oh, this is tragic. Check it out. 
Uh-oh. The Game Boy. It's a, so this is a Japan Watch. These are uh-huh. games that were out in Japan and were reported to being, you know, they're going to be coming to the U.S. Right here at the bottom, Game Boy, the second entry, Lunar Chase. Oh, my Lunar gosh. Ch- Lunar Chase. So before, have you ever heard of the game Star Fox? <laughs> That's a little joke. <laughs> So before, before uh-huh. the people who made Star Fox made Star Fox, they made a, a Game Boy version of Star Fox. Nice! A 3D, 3D flight sim, space flight simulator. Yeah! And uh, with missions and characters and absolutely incredible for the original Game Boy. Uh, without Nintendo, they didn't, they didn't even have a, a development kit or anything. They just got a Game Boy and were like, yeah, we can hack this. And then they showed it to Nintendo, and you know, Nintendo says, "You you did this like without any <laughs> development kit. Can can you pop on over to our, our office in Japan, and we'll yeah. uh, we'll discuss things further." So then they <laughs> released they released the, that game. What they developed for the finished developing that game, and then they went on to make work with Nintendo and make Star Fox, and that's how that happened. Um, Lunar Chase. So the Japanese Game Boy game. The title is X. So it's kind of a stupid name. X, oh. whatever. Oh, Just really? the letter. Just oh. Yeah. Um, and <laughs> so for the English release, they actually had a full English translation. Which? All ready to go. Okay. <laughs> Nintendo power, you got the power. <laughs> 